this video we're going to troubleshoot EIGRP neighbor relationships. We've been told that router 1 is not able to ping the loopback of router 4 in this topology. And that's true. We can't ping the loopback of router 4. Show IP route. Router 1 doesn't have any routes. Show IP protocols. Is EIGRP running on this router? Yes, it is. Notice there. EIGRP Autonomous System 1. Show IP EIGRP neighbor. No neighbor relationships are established. Show IP EIGRP interfaces. EIGRP is enabled on router 1, on interface gigabit 00, as well as loopback 0. But no relationships are being formed. The autonomous system number, once again, is autonomous system number one. Can router one ping router two? Yes, it can. Okay, router two, show IP EIGRP interfaces. Okay, here's a problem. EIGRP is enabled on the loopback and gigabit zero one, but it's not enabled on gigabit zero zero. Show IP protocols. So the autonomous system number is one, that looks good. But can you see a problem? Notice here, EIGRP is running on the loopback and gigabit zero one, but not on gigabit zero zero. So show run section EIGRP. What's the problem here? We've enabled EIGRP on the loopback and we've enabled it on gigabit zero one but it's not been enabled on gigabit zero zero. Neighbor relationship has come up now, so show IP EIGRP neighbor. We now have a neighbor relationship to router one. Show IP EIGRP interfaces, just to confirm. EIGRP is running on gigabit zero zero. So show IP protocols. EIGRP has been enabled on three interfaces, but we don't see a neighbor relationship to router three, even though EIGRP is enabled on gigabit zero one. Can router two ping router three? Yes, it can. So on router three, show IP EIGRP neighbor. No neighbor relationships. Show IP EIGRP interfaces. EIGRP is not enabled on any interfaces, so that's not good. Show IP protocols. EIGRP is enabled in Autonomous System 1. Can you see the problem? Notice here. Show run pipe section EIGRP. What's the problem? EIGRP uses an inverse mask. So this means that EIGRP will be enabled on network 10.0.0. something. This is a wildcard, so inverse mask. So EIGRP will be enabled on any interface in the network 10.0.0. This router has no interfaces in network 10.0.0 slash 24. It has networks 10.1.2.0 slash 24, 10.1.3.0 slash 24, as well as 3.3.3.3 slash 32. So I'll simply remove EIGRP and do this again. It should have been done like this. Network 10.0.0.0.255.255.255. That would enable EIGRP on the gigabit interfaces. And then we need to advertise the loopback. So we could do it this way as an example. That's an exact match on the loopback. So show run section EIGRP. EIGRP is enabled on the loopback as well as 10 networks. So show IP EIGRP interface. It's enabled now on the loopback and the two gigabit interfaces. Show IP EIGRP neighbor. We now have two neighbor relationships established. That's good. Show IP protocols shows us the networks that EIGRP is routing. So that looks a lot better. Can router one ping 
the loopback of router 4. It still can't. Can router 3 ping the loopback of router 4? It still can't. Is router 4 in the routing table of router 3? No, it's not. Okay, so let's have a look on router 4. Show IP EIGRP interfaces. EIGRP is only enabled on gigabit 00. And we have a neighbor relationship to router 3, but EIGRP is not enabled on router 4. Show IP protocols. Can you see the problem? Notice over here, show run section EIGRP. Can you see the problem? Router EIGRP1. This means exact match, exact match, exact match, exact match. It's looking for 4.4.4.0. This interface is 4.4.4.4. So let's remove that and add it back as this, for example. Show IP protocols. That means that EIGRP will be enabled on the loopback as well as network 10.1.3.2. So show run section EIGRP. EIGRP is enabled on the loopback as well as the gigabit interface. This looks like a mistake, so let's remove that. So no router EIGRP gigabit 00. Let's look at EIGRP again. That looks better. Show IP EIGRP interfaces. EIGRP is now enabled on the loopback interface. Show IP route. The loopback interface is now being advertised. So router one can ping the loopback of router four. Remember, EIGRP uses an inverse mask to advertise networks. There are many ways to do this. That's fine and so is this. But check your masks. Make sure that they set correctly. I hope you enjoyed the video. If it was of benefit to you, please like it and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. I wish you all the very best.